All right, what is up guys, Jared Campisi. Welcome back to the channel. Today is a very exciting, monumental day for myself and the beautiful Woo! Christina. We're heading to get the keys to our dream house and I cannot freaking wait. So we're back in Pennsylvania. We have moved back to Pennsylvania, my hometown. We're back in my mom's house, basically the place that started it all for our channels. And uh, we're just really, really excited to start this next chapter and share the whole process with you guys. So without further ado, sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. Look at the baby. These guys have gone across the country for the first time. They went, moved out of their house, went into a hotel. Now they're, they're, then they flew across the country. Now they're in my mom's house. And soon they will be in our new house. But uh, my mom actually lives on the back of a preserve. So we actually get some beautiful views, even though it is raining today and pretty much every day for the next 10 days. But hey, this is what you guys wanted. You said you wanted the Pennsylvania content. So we're gonna give it to you and uh, we're just gonna enjoy it and embrace it. It's kind of nice to have weather, don't you think, teens? Yeah, it's a nice change of pace. Yes. From the always sunny constantly and feeling like you have to do stuff every day because yeah. it's so nice. Now so. we can just relax today, not at all, but you know what I mean. Yeah, anyway, what is it like 6 a.m. Cali time? Yeah, something like that. So we're beat up. But um, I think what we're going to do is head down. We have to do our final walkthrough of the house with the realtor. Then we have to go sign the papers, do all the closing stuff. Then we get the keys officially. And um, I'll show you guys as much of the process as I can. Might just wait until we grab the keys and then I'll do a little walkthrough. We have to measure and you know, start to buy some furniture and stuff like that. Um, and just do a lot of errands today. So we'll take you guys along for the ride. All right, so we're heading to the house for final walkthrough right now. I'm not gonna show you guys any of this because it's gonna be a lot of us talking to the realtor about things. But I'll tell you what, I have missed these Pennsylvania back roads. These all used to be like farm roads and stuff like that. And there's just nobody on them, beautiful views, and they're so fun to drive on and uh, ride bikes on and stuff. So I hope you're excited for that content, which will be coming very, very soon. Maybe even this little one on a motorcycle. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe. Unless my mom says no. And Say hi to Nat the Rat. And this big one on the motorcycle. See? If you can't beat him, join him. Exactly. <laughs> All right. We are officially pulling up to our land and our new home. Look at that. Unbelievable. I love all these trees. And they just trimmed the grass yesterday yeah, too. Yeah, which is really nice. That's beautiful. That is insane. I can't believe this is our house. It does not even feel real. I think what I'll do, guys, since we have so much to do right now, is I'll wait to take you guys through it once we finish some other stuff inside. But yeah, here we are. Uh, just under 12 acres, just under 12,000 square feet. And this is the next compound for our YouTube channel. What do you think, Mom? Did you ever think... Uh, your son would be buying something like this. I'm getting emotional. <laughs> it's pretty insane. We did not come for money. So anyone who hasn't watched my channel or been around, my mother and us, you know, we struggled when we were small, lived in very small houses, moved around a lot, had a very rough life, things I don't want to go into. But to be here now in this situation with Christina and my mom and everything that we've accomplished largely because of you guys is pretty surreal. It just doesn't feel real. We, does both, it? we both came from that. Yeah, Christina as well. My family was She's super an poor. That's why we left the Middle East. Is like yep. We couldn't even afford to do anything. They literally eat. had like bombs going off and stuff. Yeah, it was rough. So we're not like we've come from nothing yeah, this is not family money or anything like that everything we have we've worked our asses off to have so all right so we're at turnkey realty uh this is my good buddy edwin tishner he is our realtor actually so went to high school with him played sports with him and uh, he's the one that actually helped us get this house without this guy right here it literally would not have happened so if you guys are in central pennsylvania you need to uh, buy or sell a house this is your man right here. You're going to be seeing him more on the channel because we're going to be partying running around <laughs> at our house as well. But uh, yeah, major, major thank you to this guy right here. And uh, we're going to go through all of the documents right now, which we're not going to show you. But afterwards, you might go out and have some food and drinks. So stay tuned for that. All right, so the paperwork is all done. We are officially homeowners. Homeowners, woo, first, first house. house. we ever purchased. <laughs> and hopefully one of the last, because that was an insane process. Not today, that was super easy, but um, just the process. We started buying this house in December of last year. So it's been Going five the process, months, yeah. about five months to go through the whole process. And um, it's been a lot, Highs guys. Because we're self-employed, obviously, through YouTube and all that. So, oh my God, the amount of information we had to provide to the banks and stuff was just like ridiculous. I feel like I was like doing everything short of sending them like cockpicks. <laughs> Is edit. Boom. <laughs> Beep, cut. No, anyway, we're gonna all go out. I said I'll take them out for uh, lunch. So I think we're gonna go to a place called the Cork and Fork, which also sounds sexual. <laughs> and, I'm gonna have a lot of fun. And we're gonna have some food and drinks and uh, celebrate. Then we got to go back to the house. We'll walk you all. We'll walk you guys through it a little bit of it. Yeah, we got to do measurements and all that kind of stuff. All right, so we're at Finch and Fork. Is that what it's called? Cork and Fork. <laughs> 
Okay. Um, we did a chef's selections of meats and cheeses. I would tell you what they were, but I forgot every single thing she said. Baby Jesus. I know, yeah, that's baby Jesus. We got prosciutto over here. Um, that's what we're starting with. And we got drinks too. Obviously, we had to do a cheers. I got a little juicy old fashioned up there. Cheers to you guys on YouTube as well. Food has arrived. We got chicken sandwich for Christine and I. We split that. Salad. Salad for my mom. What'd you get? Avocado salad? Yeah. Avocado salad. What'd you have, Edwin? Apple salad, my Apple friend. Apple salad. What are you going vegan on me, Edwin? Uh, dairy free. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you get, Gary? This is a uh, polpetta pizza. Fantastic. Oh, it looks it's very small. good. There's Bob. <laughs> Bob went with sliders. Oh, it's sliders. That's good then. <laughs> I love it. All right, so we're going to enjoy our meals and then we're heading back to the house. You guys will finally see the house. All right, and if you guys are wondering whose house we purchased, this is Bob right here. He owns, what do you earn? Flooring and. Yeah, Essence and Sons. Essence and Sons. And he, did you build the house or you I designed it? I yeah, okay, so this is the guy right here. I was the builder, so, and yeah. the contractor. Insanely gorgeous house. He's actually building another house down the street from us. Right. So you're gonna see more of him on the on the uh, channel. I'll put links to his uh, website and everything down in the description below if you wanna check it out. But uh, Bob is basically family. All right, pulling up to our new home for the first time with officially the keys. It does not feel real. Look at these beautiful garage doors. So we do have a three car oversized garage here and a, another three car detached garage there. That's probably gonna, gonna be what I use for the um, build series section. I'm gonna build that whole thing out. I'm gonna do this up as well. I wanna do like epoxy flooring and all kinds of stuff like that. How does it feel? Does it feel like our it's house? Real. Doesn't feel real. It feels like I'm feel. in somebody else's house right now. Yeah, it doesn't feel right. <laughs> Bob's actually heading over to grab some stuff. Um, <laughs> that he left in here that we didn't want he was going to give to us but we don't need like purple rugs and shit like that so um i'm going to take you guys inside we're going to walk through the house a little bit and uh, i'll show you what it looks like all right so here's the entrance through the garage this is the powder room which is freaking massive that's the door out to the guest or the detached garage here's the uh, first bathroom i'm not going to do like a whole full-on tour right now because uh, we have stuff to do this is actually a, the butler staircase that goes up to the guest bedrooms uh, pantry, which is absolutely massive. Hey, Here's our Edwin kitchen. What up? Oh, yeah So Edwin actually had drawings done of the house. These are hand-drawn drawings um, That Edwin's our realtor. Yeah of the front and the back of the house. Look how absolutely by Jonathan Frazier Stunning those are so that's the front of the house. That is incredible. Yeah. We're definitely gonna put these somewhere like Edwin. It. Thank you Yeah, so <laughs> The house, as I mentioned, just under 12 acres, just under 12,000 square feet. It's actually 15,000 if you include the basement. But the way that they laid it out, it doesn't feel like completely massive, right? I guess for two of us, it's going to be a little bit big. But um, it has a bar off of the uh, kitchen, which is super cool. And it comes, it comes with a bartender. Oh, yeah, Bob let us some drinks. Stella, absolutely, I want a Stella. Um, we're gonna be doing some measurements because we need to get measurements for the TV up here. Yeah, it's it's hard for the size of this to come across on uh, on on the uh, camera, but it is like if you're wondering, yes, a jacuzzi can fit 25 people. Yeah, we'll go. Actually, let's step out there real quick. Let's go ahead. Do you know how to open this up? Um, yes. The furniture that you see here, we did purchase like a bunch of the furniture here on the first floor in the outdoor area. Look at this, guys. Oh my gosh. This is our house. This is insane. So we have a covered outdoor patio, which is like an outdoor living room, which is super dope. And then this is our backyard. We have an outdoor kitchen that we're going to build in, getting like a grill and all that. Look at all this space. Have like, you know what you see on like America's Funniest Home videos or like... TV or like funny YouTube videos where there's always a bunch of people and they play like stupid games and they're yes. yards and they like they like do kickball and they like uh -huh. jump and jump like in the pool, pool and drink something. I want to like look at this yard. Space. Yeah, I just want to do something. Uh huh. Like Open up the yeah. gate there yeah. and just yes, absolutely have like a slip and slide. Yeah, yeah. A little bounce house Dude, or something. Dude, look yeah. at this pool, guys. So this gets opened on Friday. It's Monday as of me filming the video, May third. Uh, the pool gets opened on Friday. Look at this. Look at this hot tub. It can fit like 25 people in here. Um, all of this is hooked up into like your phone, so you can heat and cool the pool just with your phone, your smartphone. Turn on the fireplace, put the waterfall on. Like it's insane. This is the outdoor kitchen. We have a regular fireplace, so we can sit out here and have s'mores. And we have a beautiful views of Appalachian Mountains. And this is just like, it doesn't even feel real. <laughs> right there is where my build series is gonna take place. So it'll be a combination of Dado's garage and then I'm gonna deck out my garage so that we can do build series here. We 
can push bikes out here and, and wrench on bikes in the backyard with Christina and her friends swimming in the pool and create content that literally doesn't exist on YouTube, but it's just absolutely stunning out here. Look at this, we can have massive parties. Master bedroom's right in there. Actually, let's head back on si inside. So actually, we're back in the kitchen. Uh, one thing that I loved about it is that they have um, fridges built in. So we have a double fridge here, which is freaking gorgeous. And then obviously double freezer. And then there's actually another refrigerator in the bar as well. He's got like reverse osmosis going on, osmosis systems, so there's like fresh water everywhere here. The property actually has three wells, so we don't pay for water. Um, and it's uh, geothermal heating and cooling, so it's super efficient. And that's pretty much electricity is the only, and internet is like the only utilities really. Um, fireplace, again, um, natural gas. And there's actually two 1,000 pound propane tanks buried in the backyard for each side of the house. So it's like actually ridiculous. This is our uh, home entertainment system. It's built into the house, which is really nice. We purchased the art that they had there because I just thought it was nice to have something up on the wall. This is 30 foot vaulted ceilings in the uh, living room. Uh, this is one of the areas we need to measure for today because we need to get a TV and uh, a couch and all that kind of stuff in here. Here's the uh, office. office. Welcome to Christina's office. So we did purchase the uh, office desk, which he yeah, modeled after all of the granite and the, and the wood, well not woodwork, um, stonework on the house is from local quarries and stuff, which is super cool. Built-ins, yeah, we need to get a TV for there. But this is just, I've never seen anything like this before. All real wood, you know. Actually, his geothermal heating and cooling system, they have, um, what is the teens humidifiers yeah. plugged into it so it actually keeps the wood properly humidified this is the master bedroom in here um, we have you know that's how we control our heating and cooling we've got our alarm systems here which is badass this is a smart house so on here you can play music and all that it still says their names that's hilarious um, it can be hooked up to your phone there's speakers all throughout the whole house so it's a smart house all that kind of stuff, which is really cool, is our master bedroom opens straight out to the outdoor uh, living room and uh, to the pool and stuff too, which is really, really nice. Right here we have our master bathroom, which I'm sure Christina's very excited about. Look at our selfie mirror. Yeah, huge <laughs> selfie mirror, look at this thing. Massive selfie meter, hello. Selfie meter, mirror, sorry. Yeah, um, the bathroom. Different literally is insane. It's so gorgeous. It's the materials that they used and the woodwork. It's just, oh my gosh. What do you think, teens? Which one are you gonna take? I'm gonna take that far one. You're gonna take the far one? Yeah, you can have the close one. I'm gonna have the close one? Okay, yeah. cool. And then you got a little tub here, a claw soaking foot tub. tub, soaking tub. Teens will definitely use that. Um, there's where I'm gonna be doing all of my thinking. All my big, <laughs> all my big projects, which is nice. You can look out the, uh, the window, beautiful views while you're uh, doing a number two. Okay. <laughs> and with that, we are out of Do you want to show them the uh, closet real quick? No, it's just a regular oh, yeah. closet. Yeah, just a regular closet. That's as big as, you know, Echoes your, in your living room. Uh, laundry room, which is nice. There's two, one down here just for the master and then one upstairs for the uh, guest bedrooms. Should we yeah, show them? basically just three guest bedrooms. Yeah, it's just guest bedrooms. We'll show you guys guest bedrooms and all that kind of stuff once we uh, get the furniture for that. Well, we're gonna take it down on the stairs. This is really nice though, real quick. This table is beautiful. So we did purchase their dining room set um, because we really, really liked it. It's all like beautiful uh, wood and stuff like that. So that's really nice, yeah. And then we'll show you the basement. Probably one of my favorite parts of the house is the basement. So. Let's go down and take a look. Ooh, it's cold down here. Yeah. All right. This is probably one of my favorite parts. Check this out, guys. Whoops. <laughs> wrong one. Wrong one. <laughs> look at this. Movie theater room. Movie theater room. Teens, go up there so they can get a, like a, a feeling for the scale. Look at that. <laughs> the room oh, yes. is freaking massive. And the whole room is like sound deadened so that you can be down here watching crazy movies and the rest of the house you don't hear yeah, anything. Yeah, can hear you, yeah. which is nice. And he actually like insulated, double insulated the walls. Um, even the inside walls are insulated. So it's super, Extra super bathroom, quiet. And then this is gonna Extra be bathroom our... down here. Thank you. You've got to stop turning I, I the lights off. I don't have the lights yet. Yeah, you got to stop and turning the lights off. Yeah. 
Nice thing about the basement is it's a walkout basement. So if I wanted to in the winter time, I could even push bikes down in here to wrench on stuff, but I'll probably get heating and cooling in the detached garage. That way I can just keep them out so there. Be like an entertainment yeah. center over here, couch and TV. Then we have a ping pong table here where we're gonna kick not only Phil's ass, but also Jared's My dad, dad's ass. Uh -huh. so they think they can beat us. Don't worry, we'll film it for you guys. So that's what that's, this is gonna be our gaming setups. Our yeah, gaming area, right, armor. gaming area. So people come to stay with us, they'll game with us over here. So there's darts as well, and then more storage. You should see, show them the size of the storage area. And then, it's big. I mean, oh, no, we gotta show them the gym. Fun. Gym. Where the gym's gonna be. Home gym, guys. What do you think? How freaking sweet is that? Squats. If you want to see some home workouts on the channel, drop a comment. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. This is where I will be kicking Jared's ass at darts when I'm really good. Okay. Wait, I wanted to show him this. Oh, the storage. Yeah, I've never seen storage areas this big. Is it one of those lights? Yeah, it's this there one. Look at this. It's basically like a whole portion of the upstairs, the underneath. Look at this storage area. The storage. <laughs> it's freaking so it's, it's insane, and dude. A lot more in it just keeps the going on and, next and garage, off. So. Yeah. Yeah. That's how you can get to the. I can store uh, a lot of crap down here with Jared's house. Good. Garage. Thank God. As long as it's not in corners of the house, I'll be I happy. Can store it down here. Look at her. So we're outside here at the detached garage. Look at the view. like. There's just nothing around. We can start cars and motorcycles up whenever we want and film. This is gonna be the Camp Easy Customs headquarters. I'm gonna deck this place out. There's a loft up above it. Look at the size of this, guys. I'm gonna epoxy the floors. I'm gonna do a whole like dream garage build out uh, series in this B, but look at this. This is incredible. I haven't been up here yet either, actually. Let's take a look-see Lucy. All right, let's see what we got. Look at all this space, dude. When Jared's being a bad boy, he's gonna sleep up here. It's is that right? The dog house. Yeah. Is that what we're gonna do? So Put me in the dog house, yeah. huh? Okay, fair enough. I probably will re like finish that up there, and then bring heating and cooling into this it's garage. Not too bad here. No, it's not at all. And then this will be like the old Camp Peasy Customs build-out garage. Get lifts in here, epoxy the floors, beautiful artwork. It's vaulted ceilings. Oh my god. I can have so many motorcycles in here. It's gonna be holy crap. Oh, I can't believe this is ours. It's it doesn't feel real. That's that's for sure. It's been a hell of a journey to get here. The last three months of our lives have oh, been December. January, February, March, April. Five months. May, we're in May. Yeah. Five months. The last five months of our lives have been insane. Just non-stop, all day, every day, to get to this point, so. Look at your mom's car. I know, it looks so in tiny there. in there. But yeah, that's it. This is the new Camp Peasy compound. Slash Casa, Khalil compound. Yeah, Casa de Camp Peasy slash Khalil. I don't know, come up with some names for us in the comment section below. <laughs> Um, this is going to be Wieners compound. <laughs> where we create some epic, epic content, uh, you know, between Dado's garage, our house, my dad, my mom, my parents, my family. I want to invite big YouTubers out here, uh, Street Speed's just down the street from us, you know, In Shane Designs, uh, 650 is going to come visit and bring his bikes and, and everything. And uh, now we have a place for everybody to stay. So yeah, this is it guys. This is our first home that we purchased together. <laughs> It's very scary, a massive purchase, but um, you know, that's what you gotta do. You gotta take risks and you gotta continue to grow and uh, just do what you feel is right. And I'm super, super excited for this. Are you excited? I'm stoked, it still doesn't feel real. Yeah, this is the next chapter of our lives. So we're gonna be bringing you guys along for the whole thing, getting furniture when our stuffed cars and all of our stuff arrives. If you guys enjoy these types of videos, let us know in the, down in the comment section below. Whew. What a change it is from California, but honestly, I grew up out here, so I love like nobody being around. It feels right for me. Yeah. I just, the memories that we're gonna create here and share with you guys is gonna be absolutely epic. So yeah, that's it. Let us know what you guys think of the house in the comment section below. Um, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.